<coughs> okay, so uh, I'm sorry for being ignorant about this, but what exactly is a vegan and what has made you a vegan? Okay, so a vegan is a vegetarian, but a vegetarian who does not uh, use any animal or animal byproducts, which essentially means I don't use or eat eggs, uh, any kind of dairy or dairy products. So no ghee, butter, milk, uh, paneer, cheese, cream, anything. Uh, in addition, I don't even use honey or leather or woolen sweaters or any of those things. So that's who a vegan is. Um, basically someone who's a serious vegetarian. Okay, so what, what motivated you to become a vegan? Um, back in 2001 when I moved to the United States to pursue my higher studies, uh, I always thought I was a ethical or a compassionate vegetarian. Mm -hmm. You know, born and brought up in a Gujarati family, I always thought that that is who I was. Um, and uh, I was in a grocery store one of the days and I bought ice cream, I bought some chocolates. And, uh, sorry, please. Yeah, I know. Okay, go ahead. So, yeah. Oh, this okay. yeah. So you have your edited? No, that's okay. I'll do it. Yeah. Uh, so I was at this grocery store and I was buying ice creams and chocolates. And then my roommate pointed out, who was an ethical vegetarian, pointed out that these have eggs in it and you are wearing a leather belt, you have a leather wallet. And so I asked him, what's the problem with these things? And so he started sharing a lot of literature with me. And once I read all this literature, to me I made the connection that there is no difference between a glass of milk, a leather wallet, or a piece of egg or a piece of meat. Mm -hmm. Now if I was not going to eat a piece of meat as a vegetarian, how am I consuming the other things? Right. And so I made that connection and at that point I was not able to reconcile between my compassionate thoughts and my cruel actions. So to reconcile between those two, I had to go vegan. I literally turned vegan overnight and uh, I have been a vegan for the last 14 years now.